Good morning. Good morning. I'm trying to talk quiet because Justin is sleeping. Shh. Welcome to my channel. My name is Kat and today we're trying a new foundation and I'm so excited. It is by the brand called Uma Beauty, I believe. Yes, I got the shade Honey Honey, I believe. Is that what happened here? Honey Honey T2C. This is what she looks like. Yes. I saw Nady from Poplux, oh I love him, use this foundation a few weeks ago and he actually got the same shade as me. <laughs> well, I mean I got the same shade as him because it just looked similar. This says 99% found a perfect shade mat match. It's early. 95 said it's second skin or lightweight. Better be full coverage though, because I like to be beat. You'd best believe it. Dermatologic, dermatologically test it. Paraffin free, blah blah blue. It says, say what? Say bye bye to one size fits all foundation and how you do into this white, weightless, long lasting, adjustable coverage, hydration foundation formula for you. Enriched with pigments designed to think like your skin. Okay. And to instantly perfect the skin with a vibrant matte finish. Alright. Let's try it on. Oh, I'm going to put a primer on. I'm going to put the Touch and Soul No Problem primer on. As you can see, I fake tanned like a mother last night because it's been a while because I had a chemical peel and my face was peeling, so I could not fake tan. Let's have a little bit of mood music, shall we? It smells different, not terrible, but different. Kind of sunscreeny ish. I think that that looks beautiful, mate. My pores are a little bit enhanced, but that's normal because I have giant crater pores. But overall, I'm loving it so far. Yeah. I'm going to finish up my face off of camera, and then we'll have a little chat ski about this. Yes. Well, well, well. I am really fucking tired. I'm really tired. It's fine. It's fine. I love it. I love getting up so early. So, what do we think of the foundation? Hmm. I love it. I love it. Is it better than my next day matte but not flat? No. I don't know if I'll ever find anything that will beat that foundation. I love it, but this is so pretty. I really like this. It does accentuate my pores a tiny bit, but I also have pores the size of what a meteor crashing into cement would look like. I have huge pores. It's just, it is what it is. Okay? Just, I'm who I am. Let's see if I can come super close to you. I don't know if I'm into that right now. Yes, I am. Okay. Hello. I really love this. Now it is supposed to be 35 degrees today and I work basically outside. 
So let's see how this foundation holds up throughout the day and if I look like a crazy mess, then this foundation didn't hold up, I guess. Anyways, so far it's absolutely gorgeous. I did put, you saw me put the primer on, put the foundation on, I put some banana powder on and some bronzer. And then my MAC Fix Plus. I can't tell you how fucking long it takes to straighten this hair. To blow dry it and straighten it. Oh my god. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later tonight. Bye! It's been a long day. But look at my foundation. Right? Hello? So I do wear glasses when I'm at work. So... Oh, tiny bits come off here, but considering I was in 32 degree weather all fucking day, my foundation lasted all day. I've had it on for 13 hours now, and I really do love it. I do recommend this. With taxes uh, and shipping and all that good stuff, it did come to about $65 Canadian. Is it worth it? Yeah. Yeah. It is. I really like it. Again, it is called Uma. Uma? U-O-M-A. Beauty. And she's a keeper, guys. I really love her. I am a wee bit shiny, and I don't I'm normally not very shiny. What? But again, that could be just because I was in extreme heat today. And this girl is very warm right now. Where do these accents come from? I just don't know. I don't know. Okay? There's something wrong in my brain that triggers it. Yeah. I really love it. I feel like, I felt like a babe all day long. Yeah. Pretty. I didn't have to do any touch-ups, though I normally don't do touch-ups. Even when I come home at lunchtime, I have two big dogs, very little time, so I don't usually touch up my makeup unless it's a goddamn mess. Unless it's a fucking mess. Even then, I just don't care. I'm working with vehicles all day. Don't care. Don't care. Kinda. But not really. I absolutely recommend this foundation. I don't know, man. It's been a long day. This is an energy drink, not a beer. Guys, if you could do me a fave, if you could please comment on what is your favorite foundation, I'd really love to know. Please try the NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat because it is so good, and I want to know if it is so good for you guys too. But yeah, I'd love to hear from you guys because nobody comments. I feel lonely on my channel, so I'm trying to do a good job. Subscribe. Catch you on the next one. Bye.